Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the <coughs> Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, never shall be world without an Amen. O my, my Jesus, Jesus, forgive us our sins. Sin. Save us from the fire of hell. And lead all souls into heaven, especially heaven. those most need your divine mercy. The fifth mystery, the crucifixion. Intention for good relationship of youth and their parents. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my, o my Jesus, Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fire of hell. And lead and those souls into heaven, especially those most need to your divine mercy. mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Hail, Mother Holy of mercy. mercy. Hail, our life, our, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, for children of Eve. 
to the vision of our size, mourning and weeping in his valley of tears. Turn the most vicious advocate, your eyes of mercy towards us. And after our exile, so unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, Holy Mother of God, that we may worthy the promises of Christ. Litany of the Blessed Virgin Mary. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. God the Father in heaven, have mercy on us. God the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Holy Mother of God, pray for us. Holy Virgin of Virgins, pray for us. Mother of Christ, pray for us. Mother of Divine Grace, pray for us. Mother most pure, pray for us. Mother most chaste, pray for us. Mother in violet. Pray for us, Mother undefiled. Pray for us, Mother most admirable. Pray for us, Mother most admirable. Pray for us, Mother of good counsel. Pray for us, Mother of our Creator. Pray for us, Mother of our Savior. Pray for us, Mother of the Church. Pray for us, Virgin most prudent. Pray for us, Virgin most venerable. Pray for us, Virgin most renowned. Pray for us, Virgin most powerful. Pray for us, Virgin Most Merciful. Pray for us, Virgin Most Faithful. Pray for us, Mirror of Justice. Pray for us, Seat of Wisdom. Pray for us, Cause of Our Joy. Pray for us, Spiritual Vessel. Pray for us, Vessel of Honor. Pray for us, Singular Vessel of Devotion. Pray for us, Mystical Rose. Pray for us, Tower of David. Pray for us, Tower of Ivory. Pray for us. House of gold. Pray for us. Ark of the covenant. Pray for us. Gate of heaven. Pray for us. Morning star. Pray for us. Health of the sick. Pray for us. Refuge of sinners. Pray for us. Comforter of the afflicted. Pray for us. Help of Christians. Pray for us. Queen of angels. Pray for us. Queen of patriarchs. Pray for us. Queen of prophets. Pray for us. Queen of apostles. Pray for us. Queen of martyrs. Pray for us. Queen of confessors. Pray for us. Queen of virgins. Pray for us. Queen of all sins. Pray for us. Qu Queen conceived without original sin. Pray for us. Queen taken up into heaven. Pray for us. Queen of the most holy rosary. Pray for us. Queen of peace. Pray for us. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. O God, who only begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the reward of eternal salvation. Grant the beseech thee that meditating upon this mystery of the most holy rosary of the blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. The memorari, remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who prayed to protection, implored your help, or sought your intercession, was left unaided. Inspire this confidence, I fly unto you, O Virgin, O Virgins, my mother. To you I come, before you I stand. Saint Paul and Sorrow Paul, O Mother of the World Incarnate, not despite my petition, but in your mercy, hear and answer me. Amen. The Memorari. Remember, O Most Gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who prayed to protection implored your help or sought your intercession was left unaided, inspire this confidence, I fly unto you. O Virgin of Virgins, my mother, to you I come, before you I stand. Saint Paul and Sorrow Paul, mother of the world incarnate, not despise my petition, but in your mercy, hear and answer me. Amen. Mother of perpetual help, pray for us. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Morning.
imong pagamuma sa larawan mong puno sa paghikugma salamat nay sa pagtuyog kanamo sa kanuna Sa kanunayng panapang Ikaw ang tangpanahan sa tanan Gituyan mo Hinigum mo ang katawahan Patulong kang Jesus Ang amo Oh 
My sisters and brothers, good morning. Welcome to the celebration of the Holy Eucharist. A few reminder. Please be reminded to strictly observe the health and safety protocols, maintain physical distance, and wear your face mask and face shield while inside the church. Thank you. In this mass, we include the following intentions. We pray for the souls of our beloved departed. Isaiah John. Jason, Reynaldo, Nina Cheryl May, Rodolfo, Erlinda, Esteban, Clarence, Pedro, Lucia Jr., Jeffrey, Narcisa, Elizabeth, Dr. Helen Grace, Toribia, Patricia, Amada, Eulalia, Engelberto, Arturo, Troy Dino, Julius Fernando, Jose George Jr., Teresita, Jesus, Jose, Sehon, Teresita, Emilia, Remy, Feliciano, Alex, Apollonia, Rogelio Sr., Dennis, Francisco, Sofronio, and all souls in purgatory. We also offer prayers of thanksgiving to our Mother of Perpetual Help, to all saints and angels, for blessings and graces received, by Narcisa Banyanola, Adelin Taylor, for birthday of Zaldi Noblezada, Loida Ordiz, Antoinette Inde, Nicarlito, for total recovery of Anthony Hamias, for wedding anniversary of Mr. and Mrs. Constancio Lomoc, for second year anniversary of agreement by Dr. Nani and Minda, for for good health, safety, and protection of families. Petitions for special intentions of Felimida and family, Anne and Bill, Nestor Ma and family, Romy and Nana Ma and family, Nancy Herrera, Bebe and Domingue Sima Franca, Itan King family, Oscar and Evelyn Grappa and family, Tev family, Luz Mamburam, Malu Tampos, for early and fast recovery of Raul Espuerto and Milagros Abapo, for peace of mind. Let us pray the Angelus, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. We, Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For our hearts, we beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross, be brought to the glory of his resurrection, to the same Christ our Lord. Amen.
In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. My dear friends, welcome to our celebration of this Holy Eucharist. And for us to be ready to celebrate these sacred mysteries, let us first call to mind our sins and ask the Lord for His pardon and strength. You were sent to heal the contrite of hearts, Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. You came to call sinners, Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. You are seated at the right hand of the Father to intercede for us, Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. And may Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. Almighty ever-living God, increase our faith, hope, and charity, and make us love what you command, so that we may merit what you promise. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Romans. Brothers and sisters, I speak the truth in Christ. I do not lie. My conscience joins with the Holy Spirit in bearing me witness that I have great sorrow and constant anguish in my heart. For I could wish that I myself were accursed and cut off from Christ, for the sake of my own people, my kindred according to the flesh. They are children of Israel, theirs the adoption, the glory, the covenants, the giving of the law, the worship, and the promises. Theirs the patriarchs, and from them, according to the flesh, is the Christ who is over all, God blessed forever. Amen. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. Glorify the Lord, O Jerusalem. Praise your God, O Zadon, for he has strengthened the bars of your gates. He has blessed your children within you. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. He has granted peace in your brothers. With the best of wheat, he fills you. He sends forth his command to the earth. Swiftly runs his word. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. He has proclaimed his word to Jacob, his statutes and his ordinances to Israel. He has not done thus for any other nation. His ordinances he has not made known to them. Alleluia. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory is to you, O Lord. 
On a Sabbath, Jesus went to dine at the home of one of the leading Pharisees. And the people there were observing him carefully. In front of him, there was a man suffering from dropsy. Jesus spoke to the scholars of the law and Pharisees in reply, asking, Is it lawful to cure on the Sabbath or not? But they kept silent. So he took the man, and after he had healed him, dismissed him. Then he said to them, Who among you, if your son or ox falls into a cistern, should not immediately fall him out on the Sabbath day? But they were unable to answer his question. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, O Lord Jesus Christ. For the Jewish culture, Sabbath is to be a day of rest, a day of returning to God. And it is also similar with us. Sabbath should also be a day of rest, a day of worship, and a day of returning to God. That's why every Sunday is supposed to be our rest day and our day to worship God. However, it is not just the mere observant of the Sabbath custom or law that makes us good Christians, that makes one a good person who is really following God and following His ways. But rather, it is love and mercy. Jesus once again breaks the rules or His culture. While He was at table in the house of a Jewish leader, a man suffering from dropsy was brought in and he was laid down in front of Jesus. Jesus did not immediately heal the man. First, he addressed the Pharisees and the learned scholars who were present there. He asked them if it was proper or lawful to heal on the Sabbath. They do not reply. They just kept silent. Jesus then healed the man and sets him free of his infirmity. Law, rules, regulations are important in our world. However, the purpose and intent of the law is to ensure safety, security, peace, harmony, and for the common good of the peoples of the world. However, at times, we may put the rules, the laws, before what is loving and healthy for an individual, family, or community. True, we may be keeping the law or the rule. However, we may be breaking the greatest commandment that is loving your neighbor. Jesus today help us and challenges us to be mindful. Mindful to use the law for the good of others and not just for the sake of keeping the rules and at the same time for the sake of benefiting from the law because we cannot avoid that certain people benefit from the law, especially those who are in authority, in power, those with high influence, they will use it and benefit from it for their own sake. Like the Pharisees and the scholars, they want to get rid of Jesus, so they keep using the law for their own benefit. So there are two things that Jesus challenges us from in today's gospel. Using the law for one's own benefit, for one's own interest, and at the same time, just keeping the law to the letter, an attitude 
of too much legalism. So these are the two attitudes versus observing the law because it promotes what is good for many, not just for the individual. So my dear brothers and sisters, how do we observe the rules and the law among us in our society, in our nation, especially our Christian law or the law of the church? Do we understand that it is for the sake, for the goodness, for the health of human being that God blesses and instituted the Sabbath? You have six days to work, one day to rest. And the purpose of that is for the goodness of man, not that man become enslaved to the rules and to the law. So what Jesus is trying to remind us, especially what he's trying to teach the Pharisees and the scholars of the law, that they even do something if an ox falls into a cistern during Sabbath. How much more this person who is suffering from dropsy? Can God allow this person not to be cured, not to have healing, when God or when Jesus can do it even on Sabbath? Should the Sabbath hinder us from doing good things, doing good works? We also need to understand this, that it is not enough for us to be just doing our Sunday obligations but neglecting to do what is good for other people. So my dear brothers and sisters, how do we understand our Christian duties and obligation? Do we see it as an act of loving, an act of mercy, or just a mere following of certain regulations? Please rise. Let us pray to God our Father who has called us all his sons and daughters to become free in his Son, Jesus Christ. Our response, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That Christians may regard the commandments of God as doors to freedom from sin and evil. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That we may never put law above people, but practice first the great commandment of loving one another. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That we may have the true spirit of charity in dealing with the poor and the oppressed, and that we may see Christ in them. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That the sick, and those in the hospitals may be healed of their infirmities. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That the dead may now rest in the company of God. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. In silence, we offer to God our own personal intentions. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Lord God, let every command of yours be to us an invitation to love and to serve our brothers and sisters, to understand and to respect, to guide and be guided. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen.
brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be made acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Look, we pray, O Lord, on the offerings we make to your majesty, that whatever is done by us in your service may be directed above all to your glory, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Father most holy, through your beloved Son, Jesus Christ, your word to whom you made all things, whom you sent as our Savior and Redeemer, incarnate by the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin, fulfilling your will and gaining for you a holy people. He stretched out his hands as he endured his passion, so as to break the bonds of death and manifest the resurrection. And so with the angels and all the saints, we declare your glory as with one voice we acclaim. are indeed holy, O Lord, the found of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread, and giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving you thanks, he gave it to his disciples saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world, and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis our Pope, and Romulo our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life, and we praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, and with him, and in him, 
O God, the Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. At the Savior's command and form by divine teaching, we dare to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity, in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace, peace be, be with you. Behold the Lamb of God, behold Him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those who are invited into the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say, say the, the word, word, and my soul shall be healed. Before lining up for communion, please be mindful of our zone ushers who are present to help in guiding you for the proper communion flow. For those who are at the church grounds, kindly remain in your place during the communion. The lay ministers and seminarians will go to you. Thank you very much for your compliance. An act of spiritual communion. O oh my Jesus, I believe you are truly present in the most blessed sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to possess you within my soul. Since I am unable now to receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you now as being already there, and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen.
Let us pray. May your sacraments, O Lord, we pray, perfect in us what lies within them, that what we now celebrate in signs may one day possess in truth, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Let us pray together the Oratio Imperata. Merciful and compassionate Father, we come to you in our need to seek your protection against the COVID-19 virus that has disturbed and even claimed lives. We ask you now to look upon us with love and by your healing hand, dispel the fear of sickness and death. Restore our hope and strengthen our faith. We pray that you guide the people thus to find cures for this disease and to stem its transmission. We thank you for the vaccines developed made possible by your guiding hands. Bless our efforts to use these vaccines to end the pandemic in our country. We pray for our health workers that they may minister to the sick with competence and compassion. Grant them health in mind and body, strength in their commitment, protection from the disease. We pray for those afflicted. May they be restored to health, protect those who care for them. Grant eternal rest to those who have died. Give us the grace in these trying times to work for the good of all and to help those in need. May our concern and compassion for each other see us through this crisis and lead us to conversion and holiness. Grant all this to our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. We fly to your protection, O Holy Mother of God. Do not despise our petition in our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers. O glorious and blessed Virgin, amen. Our Mother of Perpetual Help, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Saint Raphael the Archangel, pray for us. San Roque, pray for us. San Lorenzo Ruiz, pray for us. San Pedro Calungsod, pray for us. Peace all rise. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go forth, the Mass is ended. Thanks be to God. Amen.